hello and welcome back so in the previous video we added the aim animation okay and the aim walk animation now let's complete all of the others which are remaining so open up the rifle script and right here we added some few animations when we are firing we can play the fire animation and when we are not firing we will simply not fire but let me show you the catch in the game if we come back right here try to play the game now you will notice that when we are firing and when we are aiming as you can see when we play the fire he actually just stop right that okay we don't want that okay and when we are walking and we are firing as you can see he doesn't play the fire walk animation as you can see he just play the fire and the walk animation okay we don't want that so in order to fix this let me close the game get back to visual studio and right here we have saying right here that when we are fighting we want to play these two animation okay you just want to play the fire animation you don't want to play that one but now in the else if what we will say we will say that if we are firing okay so just copy that from above there paste it down below so if you are firing and also if we are moving okay so we have the move code on the switch camera so we can actually just copy that from there paste it down below so now if you are firing and if you are moving then what we want to do we want to make the idle animation false we don't want to play that we want to play the idle aim animation okay we will set that to true okay because uh, if you are walking and aiming then we will play the fire walk but if we stop walking and we are still aiming then we want the idle aim to be true okay because if this is false then it will just mess up the animations okay we want this one to we also want the fire walk to be true and we want the walk to be true as well because if we are walking and aiming and then we suddenly we stop aiming then we are still walking so that's why we will set the walk to true and after that we will set the reloading to true as well because when we are walking and firing we can still reload as you can see uh, when i show you the game and just rewind the video and you saw that when we are aiming and walking and firing it just didn't reload so we want to also reload the weapon okay and then after that right here in the else when we are not walking when we are not aiming or shooting then we want just the fire walk to be false and the reloading to be false as well and now let's just save this Get back to the unity okay now if we play the game now as you can see we are walking and now if we try to shoot as you can see he is playing that animation okay okay it messed up that one let me check that again we are walking okay it is simply playing the reload again and again okay as you can see when we are shooting we can play the reload if we are walking then we want to play the walk and when we are shooting we want to play okay let me close this we set the fire walk to true we set the fire walk to false and then from there to here we set the user mode to true we will not false okay we do the same right here so I guess the reason it is doing that is because when we are walking and firing we set the reload into true so it will basically just reload again and again when we are shooting and we are walking if we play the game as you can see now the idle is true and as you can see now the walk is true as well now if we try to fire as you can see the is reloading is reloading is just 
true okay when we are walking and firing and when we are just firing as you can see when the ammo out then it plays the reload okay so in order to fix this right here in the script we can just set this to false or you can actually just remove that from there but for now let's just set it to false and now if we play the game okay now if you are walking and if you are shooting as you can see now he stops he reloads and now when we try to move walk okay and now as you can see he's reloading and when he's done reloading we can now walk again and shoot again and now he is reloading and if we try to aim and walk as you can see he is playing the aim walk animation okay so now it works and now let me show you one thing more if we are aiming and if we are firing and as you can see when the bullet finish it just didn't play the reloading animation as you can see okay it just didn't play that so for that what we will do we will right here in the rifle script we will add a else if condition for that so we will say that else if we are aiming so for that we will say input dot cut button fire 2 you can actually just copy that from here and then we will say that and if we are also firing then what we will do inside the curly brackets you can just simply copy all of this and right here you can paste it and then you can actually just save this get back to the unity and let me maximize this okay and let me zoom in and right here uh, we have a transition for the reloading right here from the shoot but now we need to make a transition from this aiming idle to this recharge okay and right here make this exact time zero remove that and right here just set the reloading to true and from the aiming recharge to the aiming idle make the reloading to false okay and now let me do this okay let me zoom in like that okay now let us simply play the game and you will notice now when we are aiming whoops let me move this a little bit down below okay so that you guys can see so now we are aiming okay now if we try to fire and when the bullet finishes as you can see now he is reloading as you can see okay now he is reloading okay so now that problem is fixed as well when we aim and when we try to fire as you can see he can reload now let me close the game and actually we can just simply again uh, play the game now as you can see when we are aiming at firing as you can see when the bullet finishes he can reload okay and when he's walking like that and firing he will stop and reload okay and let me guys just show you all of the animation that it works now okay so now if he is walking he is walking and he can also run and as you can see he can also jump he can walk and aim or he can aim and walk okay there are different types of animation and if he is aiming and walking and if we now try to as you can see when the times of reloading comes it just didn't reload the weapon as you can see it didn't play the reload animation so if you see right here we don't have any transition from the aiming walk to the recharge or you can say reload so what we can do right here is to 
first of all pause the game okay stop the game make a transition right here and remove that has exact time zero and set the reloading to true and then make a transition from this recharge to aiming walk and remove that make the reloading now false and as you know the parameter works okay as you can see we already typed the code for the reloading when the times of reloading come it will just play the reloading else it will not play the reloading animation so now if we play the game now we have the transition now if we are aiming and walking as now as you can see he's playing the aiming walk now if you try to shoot and when the bullet finishes as you can see now he is he just simply reloads the weapon as you can see let me show it to you now as you can see he is now playing the reload animation okay and he can walk now and everything looks just fine so now as you know all of the animation works really good okay now our player controller and our gun script is fully completed as you can see now we can walk we can shoot and we can give damage we can play different types of animations as you can see okay so with this video ends our all animations are now completed and our player controller is now completed he plays different animation he can shoot he can walk he can run he can give damage and now as you have guessed the next part is for the enemies we will add enemy to our game so for that catch you guys in the next video